Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here, hi, my name is Lily and I'm a senior in college and I'm about to be a summer school teacher. So that's actually what this video is about. I did one recently about my first part of my prepping for summer school. So basically how summer school works is we have a two weeks of like training community building with our teams and then we're in a classroom teaching math reading and faith because it's a christian program in our own classroom all day and this year i'm actually solo teaching and i'm solo teaching i think either first or second grade um so i went to the dollar tree and target with my mom yesterday and i was very intentional about the purchases that i made I did not buy anything unnecessary so I'm gonna show you some of the stuff I got and then I thought it would be fun to clean out my teacher bag from preschool and transition it to summer school if you can't tell by my voice I'm kind of getting over like it's not it wasn't a cold it was an asthma attack that was caused by a sinus infection and I didn't have a voice for a long time. So my voice is finally coming back. So I thought I would make a vi these videos today. So yeah, here we go. Um, so I'm gonna show you what I got at Target first because I'm pretty excited. I was not expecting them to have these this early. If you're on my Instagram, you already saw what I got. They had some book bins in their dollar section. So I got <clears throat> this one. It's like a Tiffany blue. One of my favorite colors. You guys know. And then I also got a Tiffany blue book bin, which I will be going through in a minute, showing you what books I picked for some summer read alouds. I got a red one and a blue turn in bin. So those one is going to be for math one is going to be for reading and one is going to be for things that i have to like look over or like grade and stuff like that so that's what i got those for and then the book bin i just have some books like if we have free time and i have time for a read aloud i put some fun read alouds in here i have there was an old lady who swallowed some books you are special a little spot of anxiety Pete the Cat and the New Guy. If you take a mouse to school. We're different, we're the same. A Whale of a Mistake. I love this book and I highly recommend this book. And then this is my first day of school. Little community builder we're going to do is All Are Welcome. And then I want to do this one on the last day of summer school. What will build? I just got this book and it's a really, really good one. I got two of these inflatable seats and they're rainbow and if I can't use them for summer, I'm going to save them for a year when I have my own classroom. So like next year when I'm in my own classroom, hopefully, but they're so cute. So then I went to Dollar Tree with my mom and I wanted containers for some of my mini erasers. I have a lot of summer themed ones, so I want to use them as like math manipulatives. So I found these little containers and they fit them so perfectly. So yeah, I have an abundance of these. <laughs> and they come in two or three packs, but they only had one three pack. So I bought one three pack and two two packs. And I just have one extra, but I'm going to put a different, um, like, season theme in those and then i got these little push pins that say like project to do urgent notes stuff like that so that'll be pretty helpful and then i just got some new thank you cards and this one says thank you for all the kindness you bring into the world and i just loved these i thought they were so cute and then bless your heart for being so nice so I love those and that's pretty much all the stuff I wanted to show you. 
And now let's clean out my teacher bag and switch it to summer school mode. So I did show my old teacher bag a couple months ago, but since then I upgraded to a new 31 bag. It's actually like a brand new style bag and everything and still has Miss Hyder and the apple, of course. And then there's like a big pocket in the front, but I don't know. I didn't really use it for a lot of things, um, but we're going to see what's in here after my run as a preschool teacher. First of all, I have my fort prep notebook in here because at nap time I would like study the heck out of this and you guys this is so thorough and color coded and i'm still waiting for my fort results so yeah um i have a trolls sticker book which i've gotten quite a bit of use of i use like most of this sheet and some of this sheet um i just use them as like when students go above and beyond to do things, I would like give them specifically in like the older classes. I have like 8 million masks in here. So and I have a pair of socks because this was my baby room, my baby room socks, because you had to like not wear shoes in baby rooms. So I just always had a pair of socks in my bag. I have my camelback with a little bit of water in it. I have like so many water bottles and I switch off which ones I drink out of. So yeah, um, this is my little survival kit. I will definitely be keeping this in here. It has my inhaler, my contact solution, um, a contact case, eye drops, hand sanitizer, lip balm, a mirror, um, just all that stuff that you definitely might need when you're teaching so and then in a side pocket i also just have like an abundance of lotions and some advil liquid gels but i have like this winter candy apple one i have this hemp's lotion and then I have my Utterly Smooth. Then I have my lanyard. It's naked and really sad, but it's rainbow beaded. And then I have this cute keychain that says teacher life on it. And I have two felt board, three felt board stories that I made. Um, obviously taking those out because I don't think I'm gonna need to do felt stories. Um, I have some little things that my friend got me in Hawaii. She got me this cute patch that I want to put on my jean jacket and this sticker that I want to put on something as well. Some extras of the little teas I gave people and I'm just going to keep them because chamomile tea is my favorite. I have like a ton of change in one of these pockets and then my mask chain which my mom's um co-worker made so she gave me one and i mean that's pretty much it for what's in my bag and what i'm going to put in it right now so i'm gonna put my survival kit back in here because I know I'm going to need it and I'm keeping all those lotions and my Advil liquid gels, my lanyard and my mask chain because I don't know if we have to wear masks or not. So I don't know. And then I'm going to put my pencil case in here, my wallet, and then obviously like my phone, my laptop, stuff like that. But I'm going to wait till Tuesday to do that. But I just thought it'd be fun to clean out my teacher bag because I'm transitioning jobs. So, yeah. But that is all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you on Tuesday with my summer school, first summer school vlog. Okay, bye. Stay beautiful.